Hey guys, this is DarkClawed1, and we are here with Minecraft Mondays, and uh, today's Minecraft Monday is a new map I will be doing, and uh, today's map is an interesting map name. It is called Timekeeper. Now, I, I just saw an episode one on someone's thing, didn't watch a single second of it, I just downloaded it, because I, I love the idea of a timekeeper. I thought maybe it had something to do with, I don't know. You know, just something really interesting, something different. So I, I really wanted to try it out. So, uh, so a Azur and Weevil presents a wonderful adventure full of time, mystery, excitement, danger, curiosity, puzzles, challenges, obstacles, teamwork, which will not happen since I'm alone. Um, animals, petrifying experiences, some nice ones too. Explosions, thunder, fireworks, light bulbs, snow, ice, vodka, fights, questions, and sneaky pop culture culture references. Hmm. <laughs> I th <laughs> this is gonna be a good map. I can tell. Um, found throughout the adventure are tokens: thirty-eight tokens of seeking, twelve of solving, six of teamwork. They are on an optional size uh, side of challenge uh, to the main story, but add a lot to the overall experience. Inside the first starter room, when you begin your adventure, is a book. Um, with a full list of all tokens and rough locations, you should take this with you and keep it safe. You still need to search um, and solve to find them all. Teamwork tokens are designed to require, um, uh, designed for and require two players. Everything else is, um, everything else throughout the map it will work for one player. Uh, teamwork tokens are ma marked by gold blocks around them. Okay. Um, then push button for Azra's YouTube link. Push button for Weeble's YouTube link. Okay. Um. Uh, keep clouds off in video settings. Uh, let's see, clouds are off. Uh, recommends uh, eight minimum, ten maximum. So let's go with nine just to be in between that. Um, vanilla textures, that's fine. Uh, the latest 1.8, I am in 1411B. Okay, um, I need to uh, uh, enable um, command blocks, and I have that. Done. Uh, stay in adventure mode. Okay. Many features rely on these things. Follow the story, and if you ever feel lost, talk to the NPCs again. Many give clear guidance if talked to a second time. Nothing is hidden in random parts of wilderness, so you should never need to go off the clear paths. Do not randomly discard any items you find or are given. All right. Hmm. Okay. So this is a token of teamwork, token of solving, and a token of seeking. Okay. Um, quick starter guide, token list, token overview, uh, village area, okay, I see how this works, alrighty, um, oh, look, there's an NPC, I wonder if I should talk to it, okay, um, let me just look at this, that's the token list already, token overview, there are 50 tokens to be found, finding, collecting, this is a side challenge, Token of seeking. Uh, can always be reached by simply exploring. They are only ever found in a single chest. They are sometimes hidden in plain sight, other times not so plain. There are 30 to um, 38 tokens of seeking in total. Uh, tokens of solving are reached by finding buttons, levers, plates, and etc. that reveal them. These can be hard to find. There are 12 tokens of solving, and then the tokens of teamwork, obviously I can't do that. So, um, let's get started with this awesome thing. I think I'm going to be uploading two episodes of uh, this today. As soon as the first one goes, I'm going to upload the second one. So let's get started. Uh, let's see. Welcome, another adventurer come to seek their fortune, I suppose. Well, I don't know about fortune, but you should he uh, head on uh, into the village. We could clearly, uh, certainly, use some help there. Um, you see, we seem to be on the cusp of an eternal darkness. The sun hangs on the horizon, never quite vanishing, never quite arising. Talk to the time steward on the clock tower. He might appreciate some help, if you can prove yourself trustworthy. Okay, um, this is like a spy mission. Duh. Da -na -na. Okay, let me check. Yeah, I'm on peaceful. That's good. Da -na 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 -na. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da -da. Okay, um, we're going on to a new place. All right, so let's get started here. And um, greetings. You should run and along and speak to the time steward at the clock tower. Perhaps some. Uh, perhaps come and see. Again later. Some bread. I'm just gonna steal all you have. Don't mind me. Uh, 
some seeds. I don't know. I'm, I'm just taking random things. Really don't know what I'm doing. No, I'm just kind of taking some things to make myself happy. I'm going to jump on you. Okay. Um. So, let's go. Woo. Oh, that is, oh, that is, wow. I'm actually really impressed with this map so far. It looks really good. Like, it's really nice. That, that just, that's pretty cool. I, I really, like, I want to be able to find them, but I have a feeling that I'm not going to find most of the chests. I hope that I don't have to veer from the paths, because it said I didn't have to, so hopefully I don't. Um, you know, just exploring is really what I'm going to do. I mean, those, those, like, you know, redstone torches, it's going to be a little bit harder to do those. I'm going to go over here for no reason. Amy's about. Okay, um... Please tell me there's something up here. Nope. Oh, ho, ho. a token of seeking. Look at that. <laughs> I, I just I had a feeling that I had to look through the houses to get what I wanted. Okay. Um. Next house. See some glass in there. <clears throat> I'm literally gonna look through every single house. So, uh, I'm just gonna go ahead. And uh, I'll get back to you as soon as I've looked through the houses. Okay, so I, I checked out the whole thing, and there's one token of seeking there. There is uh, two tokens of, uh, of like, uh, I think, puzzle or something over at the mayor's house, which I was just in. And uh, one of them, I have no idea how I'm going to get, because it's it's ridiculously hard actually because you have to press the button run upstairs and then grab a chest and I don't know where the chest is is the thing like I don't know where it is and I I have a feeling it's right behind me it's right here but I cannot like do that like I cannot like 360 like it up the stairs and make it in time so close. Like, I'm seeing now how I'm supposed to do this, but it's really gonna be probably the most difficult thing I've done. Ah! I can't even see if it's if I'm, like, right. Oh! Oh! Okay, let me try that. Um, press. Ah, god dang it. I didn't run up fast enough. Um, yeah, this, this is gonna be a hard a hard I don't know. Like, I cannot tell. But, um, we're gonna go to the clock tower, because over at the mill, it said, it, there was a chest that said wheat, and I have a feeling that if I find a hoe somewhere, I, I will be able to do that. And, you know, I'll be able... Okay, so, Juliet's dwelling. So, I don't know about this, but in the token list, it said Bill's windmill, clock tower, Juliet's dwelling, and the mayor's house. But I, I found one somewhere else, so I have no idea if, if like that's supposed to be the thing I'm supposed to do or like I don't know. Um oh hello there, would you like to do me a little favor and here for a token of gratitude? Okay, um sure, sure, sure. My friend Amy is out uh I think admiring the view from the top of the clock tower. Would you push her out of it? Okay, no, I'm just kidding. Um could you give her this message from me, please? Okay. I have a feeling that you're cute. Um, Swalk? Okay. I don't know what that means, but I'll do it just for you. This is gonna be a very fun map. I have no idea. Oh, welcome to the Hulk Tower. Um, oh, hello there, adventurer. As you've probably noticed by now, we have a serious problem. Yes, yes, I, I, I think I see a problem. You see, this isn't just a clock tower. This is the clock tower. It doesn't measure time. It is act. It is actually time. Okay, it is time. However, the clock seems to have frozen at dusk, and the sun is, sun is stuck, hanging, not quite dropping below the horizon. I appreciate your eagerness to help, but before I tell you more, you're going to have to prove you are a trustworthy sort capable of getting things done. Head into the village and help some of the locals out. If you can gather at least five tokens of gratitude and pull them into, to, sorry, in this chest beside me, I will tell you more. 
Just ask around the village. You could check in the nearby guard tower, the mayor's house, the windmill, the farm, or any of the houses nearby. Okay. Let's go help some civilians. Okay, um... <clears throat> so... I think I'm gonna do this one first, and he's probably gonna say, "Why don't you make all the farms work?" I don't know. Um, he's probably gonna be all like, "Harvest my wheat," and I'll be like, "Okay," and then I'll harvest his wheat, and he'll give me a token. I need to find that though. Like, I know it's either hiding in plain sight or it's not. So, um, oh, hello there, Ninja. I'm in need of help. Uh, I'm in need of gathering more crops. I'll give you a token of gratitude for this very simple task. Uh, alright, drop the wheat into the bin there, and the token is yours. Alright, so let's just gather some wheat for him, since he's lazy. Because I'm probably stronger than he is, and it makes sense. Since I'm stronger, I can help him. Alright, well, uh, now let's just wait. And hopefully he will give me a token of gratitude. Oh god, this this is gonna be this is gonna be another one of those like uh, I, he's gonna like tell me to do it like twenty five times, isn't he? He's just gonna tell me to do it over and over and over again. Oh, that sucks. He like he's gonna make me do it like forever until I'm like f you, and then he's gonna be all like, you know, oh okay, um, I will let. Uh, I'm sorry. Okay, I will get you 20 more wheat, because I completely trust you, and I don't think you're going to sell me out, or you're going to not give me that token. I believe you. I believe you completely. And here's my, here's my fist. Bang, bang, bang. I'm gonna keep banging you. <laughs> um, yeah. You're, you're a jerk. Huh. Huh. I did it. Like, that's all he's doing. It's actually impressive how they made it so that it would, like, the wheat would repair, repair itself so quickly. I didn't even notice that, you know, the wheat had been repaired at all. Um. Okay, I got one token of gratitude. Now I need to go to the mountains, apparently. I, I don't exactly know where I was supposed to go, so. Let's, let's see. Northwest past the monument and in the trees. West, north. Okay, northwest. Uh, this is this is gonna take a while. Um, Elsa's farm keeper's cottage. Let's just go into the trees. Okay. Um, this is gonna be. Oh, here it is. Private property. Keep out. Ooh. Spooky. Oh god, I'm gonna turn my brightness up. Since he cannot see anything because his house is so dark. Oh, I can't do that. <laughs> I, was, I was like trying to break wheat secretly. Ooh. Ooh. Did that do anything? Where? Ah, oh, there we go. Oh no. Oh, entry code by unknown. Leaf, life, loaf, health, death, fear, mail, filth, name, ride, fold, dirt, dire, helm, fear, fold, mold, liar, fire, tome, mate. Hold on. Where did leaf... Did leaf... So, I don't know if anything here... On, let's check. So I think the thing that was said twice is what we're looking for. Leaf was not said twice, so that is definitely not that. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a pencil. Actually, let's do this. Oh man! All right, I will get back to you as soon as I figure out what has been said twice. Thank you guys for watching, and this has been the first episode of uh, the Timekeeper. So thank you guys for watching. Subscribe, comment, like, and I will see you in the next episode, which will be today.